What's going on y'all, it's your boy Blazner here and today in this video we are outside the Bowery showroom and there's a few different places that I wanted to go to today. I'm with my man. What's going on guys? Can you get, can you get me oh, up? Thank what? you. Lil. What's up my two? Wait, no, no, hang on, we got a, we got a body. What's up my, wait, wait. No, bro, it's two. Slap, slap. Oh. I'm with my twiz today and what we're gonna be doing is going into the Bowery showroom. I'm excited because I've never been here before. Stores like this kind of excite me because they're just little <laughs> nooks inside and then we'll also go to a candy store that's down the block and then i think there's a store that's doing special steals today because it's their one year anniversary do you think they allow recording in here because they're a tiktok store you think so hey, wait wait you guys you guys want to be on the vlog it's live right now what's going on man what's your name i'm matt all right what do you do you own this place or yep i own bowery showroom like what is this store about like what can you tell us a little bit about bowery showroom we're a concept store we kind of do everything and we kind of like curate a lot of stuff like niche things from like all around the world vintage new stuff designer everything all over the place. A lot of what we carry is like streetwear, but we're like really heavy in the community. So a lot of what we carry, I would say like 60% is like local independent designers. All right, well, we're going to take a look around then, bro. So some of this stuff like right here, like that's like an art piece. Like it, what's the yes. significance of that? Yeah, so one of the owners, he does a lot of paint splatter stuff. So he took the off-whites, obviously, and this went crazy. Was that before or after Virgil passed? Oh, this is before sure. Virgil, yeah. Word. I heard you guys were doing like a pop-up on 420. Yeah, we're going to have uh, Bloody Dior and Bloody Osiris here. But yeah, the whole Bloody team's going to be here. They're going to be uh, displaying their brand like mood swings. There's going to be an exclusive drop. It's going to be lit. Everybody's oh, going to have like, we, free goodie bags. We might have to stop. We team. might have to stop at that. Yeah, this is our like high end like street wear Oh, section. this is hit in New York. They yeah, sent so me, they send me, they send me socks. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Shout out this company. Shout yeah, out him. Shout Spider. out Yachty. Oh, yeah. He's the owner. He's the admin. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this is Young Thug's brand, right? Yeah, Spider. Is that actual yeah. Kanye or is that? Yeah, this is, yeah, this is CPFM. Oh, okay, okay, CPFM. I didn't know if that was just Kanye's merch or if it was a collab. Yeah, no, it, oh, this is some old Supreme. What was that, 2016? Yeah, 2016 Arabic. Spell See, I know yeah. my shit. I don't know this new stuff, though. I'm too old head with yeah. it. Big A would go crazy for that, bro. Yeah. Because he could chop that up, make like 100 different watch so straps. What is the price on that? Uh, I don't know. I honestly, we've had this in display the whole time. But, hey, Matt. Can I, can I peep the, the strap? 700. Oh, sh. Don't fing drop anything, bro. That's crazy. Uh. All right, yeah, let's explore some more. What's some of this bottom stuff right here? Oh, this is old. Yeah, oh, like, this is like campus. Yeah. 200, oof. I mean, I feel like after that, that Virgil passing, you know, it's understandable to be honest. Is, are they so, what's the direction with Off-White? Do you know? Like, cause I don't, I don't know. didn't they what say Kanye was gonna do it? Yeah, that was a rumor. Kanye's gonna take over, but I think it's honestly gonna like, so be on like, Chrome Hearts matches, that's dope. Are the matches for sale? Nah, a lot of that stuff, like the matches and like the cars, it's all displayed. I'm gonna keep it real with the vlog, y'all. This for a hundred, like in an NYC resale shop is like probably the perfect market price, like actually. Not. And like you guys are literally here in store, like is this used? No, no, no. brand new, yeah. so, even better. I mean, it's even better. I thought it was used, I mean, it's even yeah. better. This is tough. It's so interesting, the hoodie without the hood, the kangaroo pocket. See, dang, you, you, you did bring me the right place. Dope, it's a bunch of random designers. I don't know any of this, honestly. All right, we saw these hoodies. We saw these hoodies. We saw this. All right, what about with this over here? Yeah. 160. 160. For a small. 160 for a small ABC blue. Chrome heart. Your boy does not own a chrome heart zip up. I, I got a hoodie though. Oh, Nick, this would be perfect on you, bro. Oh, oh, that's a cop. You look good in that. Show off the ass. Pause. Oh, Costello, this would be perfect on you, bro. It goes with the it actually goes with your fit. You'd be American, uh, a true American. Loki, you, turn, you just turned into the American flag. Oh, wow, yeah. I took that photo. That beautiful image. Dude, they asked me to be in it. I said, absolutely not. I don't even know what brand this is. It's cool, though. Shout out the rhinestone. Big 96. This is cool. Seven and a half. Oh, man. This is cool. 70. I'll actually put I did that twice. I'll actually pick some now. I think we might be getting some chrome. Which one should I do? Should I want? I like the ones with the big prints, and this one does not have big prints. Like it feels like it's a double. Feels, I think it's got like almost a like thermal on the inside. Feels like it on the arms. Versatile oh, piece yeah. for sure. I like the dagger on it. This is I'm assuming where the sterling silver is on the piece, because that's Chrome Hearts' thing. Is that every piece has silver on it. Oh no. Look at this zipper, bro. Costa was right. The zipper is really bad on these. You're literally just paying for logos and a look at this point because it's definitely not the hardware. Yo, thank you, man. Appreciate that. Hey, it's my first chrome zipper.
All right, well, we're at this foreign snack spot. Let's check it out. All righty. Let's see, what am I actually gonna eat? Cheeseburger Lay's? I'm definitely gonna get a drink. Oh. I think that's French Fanta or something. Well, look at that Coca-Cola. What is that? Yeah. All right, Juju's got to get a snack now. Do we get a Bev or do we get a candy? That's the thing. Oh, the Bev you could save. The candy is kind of a one shot, you know? Which one are you grabbing? G. G, give me, man. Nice to meet you, man. All right, y'all. Let's go. Thanks, man. Have a good one. I'm quenching for some grape Fanta. That tastes like legit grapes. I'm literally drinking grapes. Because, you know, grape flavoring. This tastes like grape. Fire. All right, and then the Lay's cheeseburger. Oh, my God. The first bite, the first bite tastes like meat and bun. And then you chew, and then it tastes like pickle. Meat, bun. This one had less pickle this time. It tastes like meat, meat. bun, and then pickle. pickle yeah. Yeah, what's the crazy steal, bro? Let us know. We're filming with YouTube right now. Bro, you know who I am? You want to try one of these? All right, it's a cheeseburger Lay's. We just did a little review of this uh, exotic snack spot. One of the most interesting flavors, bro. Cheeseburger. I said the same thing. It tastes like meat, bun, and then pickle. I don't know. There you go. There we go. Best steal in here today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. $100 for Mars Landing. DS. We'll take him. Perfect. We'll take him. He's a no box. That's cool, though. That's cool. We'll take him. What about those? Uh, the 14s. Yeah. The Sport Blue 14. 80 cash? Oh, oh man. It's tough, bro. Like, I know this shoe sells, but, like, it might be tough, bro. It might be tough. might be tough. 260. Those got some heel drag to them. It's good to know you guys got used, though. I didn't honestly know you guys carried used as well. These are clean. I just... They're so clean, actually, for 70. We had District 1. We were Blazing Berry. Shout out Meezy. Huge fan, so... Thank you so much, bro. Appreciate that, yo. He's like, yo, I eat you. I watch... I, I eat breakfast in the morning, watch your videos, I'm like... Appreciate that shit, man. For real, that ass. Thank you. We got a lot of New York City love. Make sure y'all come up to me, chop it up, say what's up. I mean, we're finding some off-whites here for 70. There's no used pairs on the market in this colorway. So, I mean, we'll try and run it up. Yo, I mean, this is interesting, too. $300 Panda Dunks. They are a shoe that will move. And I, I gotta say, uh, they could certainly get their full 300 out of them. It seems like even, like, when it comes to sizing, like, they don't differentiate on the price. Like, uh, 10 DS, the same price as a 9.5 is the same price as a 11 and a half, 425, 25 more on that one. Red Thunders, we've never actually had a pair of these. We're gonna probably check out pretty soon. We have a couple used pairs, cause it's their one year anniversary, so they're throwing some deals, which the deals were like market, I'd say. But like some of the used ones, like I feel like they're a little better. Damn, the Delo Mio. Oh wow, this is a steal, 300. 160. This one too, Brody. This is crazy. NYC foams for 260. What? 10 and a half, bro. I would personal this if this was a 10, dude. Yo, shooting stars foam posits 200 DS 10 and a half. Wow. Are they giving these away? I'm genuinely shocked. Some of their foam prep posit pricing is like really, really good. Bro, what are y'all charging? Wow. Wow. Oh. That's, that's friends and family canary. You guys want to see the most expensive Air Force in the world? Y'all, the Shooting Stars box, it comes in a pack. I don't even know if you guys know how OG this is, this shoe. These are where the pennies, right? The penny what? These literally remind me of like a fake Yeezy that you'd see on blogs years ago. It's crazy. All right, we got De Lo Mio's, Mid Metallic Golds, Mars Landing, Barcelona, 3 P. We got the Chrome Posits, the Off-White Tours, the Shatter Backboard, and the Shooting Stars. Definitely a dope oh. haul. I appreciate the help, man. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, bro, sure thank you that. so much. We're about to finish Yo, up the video right video. outside. All right, y'all, so we had a definite great day. Picked up some De Lo Mio's, three peats. We got some chrome posits, the mid-metallic, 
The Shooting Stars pack, Off White. Picked up some of the DS Moon Landing. We got a steal on some Jordan 1 Shatter backboard. A so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's almost close to 100 a pair, and those pairs are definitely worth more than 100. So, seriously, District 1 shot to them. Definitely give them a visit. We'll be back, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you did. We'll see y'all with some more longer vlogs like this where I throw on the mic and we literally just walk around New York City. I think those vibes are the best. I think you guys clearly seem to enjoy the longer videos. I know the shorter ones are just so we can go ahead and get our work done in the week, but we'll catch y'all in another video. It's your boy Blaze Never Sign Out. Stay positive, y'all, and peace out.